What is up, everybody? How are you guys doing? Ace, aka Animated Heroes here, back with another video. And this time I'm doing something different. As you guys know, Black Friday was recently. And if you're a toy collector like myself, nine times out of 10, you did go shopping. Or you should have. Uh, there were crazy sales all over the place. So I just picked up quite a few things. Now, for you guys that say I hate Marvel Legends, this video is going to be for you because... I picked up a ton of them, and we're going to go ahead and dive right into that haul right now. But before we get into the figures, there are some other things that I do want to discuss. Uh, I picked up a couple movies, actually only two. Uh, I've been wanting to rewatch Spider-Man for the longest, and I was waiting on this to hit Disney+, Plus, but I don't know. I guess it's just not going to happen. I've only seen this movie once. Most people probably seen it two or three times. But I never got around to the second time. I didn't make it to the theater. So now I own it and I can watch it whenever I want to. Uh, if everything works out, I'll probably watch it in the next couple of weeks. Otherwise, it'll probably just sit on my shelf for a couple of years. Who knows? That's kind of how I operate. It's unable to uh, be determined. Now, next up, I picked up a masterpiece, the greatest superhero movie of 2022. I'm calling it now. I don't care what else releases this year. I don't care about Wakanda Forever was good. Don't get me wrong, but I'm sorry. Nothing will beat this masterpiece. We have Batman, the Batman, Robert Pattinson, absolutely just decimated everything in this movie. It was so superb. It is the most comic book accurate detective Batman movie that we've gotten probably since Michael Keaton, to be honest. Gotham felt so alive. Robert Pattinson really felt like this Batman who was on a mission. Everything was so gritty, so dark. The villains were exactly what they needed to be. I just absolutely loved it, man. This movie is great. And I got this in 4K. I think this might be my first 4K movie ever. Uh, I don't know, but I absolutely love this movie. And if you're a Batman fan, then you, you should already know how I feel. This is one you have to have. This is one I'm definitely going to be re-watching re sometime soon. I don't know when, but it's going to happen soon. And yeah, I know it's on HBO Max, but when it comes to Batman, I have to have it. Now, the next couple of things I picked up, since it's not figures, I'll keep it in this segment. Um, I did pick up a couple games for the PS5. First off, I got Call of Duty. Now, I'm telling y'all right now, I have been slaughtering people in this game, man. I haven't played Call of Duty in probably about two years now. And one of my games is in here floating around. Let's see what it is. Oh, My Hero Academia. I put the movie in here. But yeah, I haven't played Call of Duty in a long, long time, man. But this one is solid. I am really absolutely enjoying this game. So if you got the PlayStation 5, a matter of fact, I'm not even going to say that because... I have too many people that want to play with me right now, and I just haven't even had time to get to them. But I did also pick up Gotham Knights. Uh, I got this for $39.99 or something like that. It initially went for like $69 or something, and I'm not playing. I'm I'm definitely not paying that for PlayStation 5 games. Uh, I'm, go I'm waiting on sales for just about everything, unless it's something that I really, really want. But anyway, that's all my movies and games. Now for what you guys have been waiting for, let's go ahead and dive right into the figures that I picked up. So in case you guys didn't know, I did try to let everyone on Instagram know. I forgot to post it on YouTube, so my bad. But I did try to let everyone know that Amazon was having a sale on this guy right here. I think they were going for roughly like $27 a pop, something like that. I don't know. But your boy had to go ahead and do it. I will probably never fit all of these in a photo, but I had to snag about three more of them. You know, it just had to be done because I'm going to support this line to the fullest so yeah had to snag three of these you guys already know shadow clone's gonna be in full effect uh so that was mandatory uh another thing that i got that i actually army built actually i'll get to those in just a sec first off i want to show something a little different that you guys probably wouldn't have been expecting me to pick up um i did grab these it was um who was it? I think Spider Criminal, who initially talked me into these. Like, they looked really good, and he was going to pick up a shadow for me if he ever found it. But uh, I did get Sonic and Tails. I'm pretty excited for these. Uh, from what I've seen, they look really good. They actually move pretty well for just $9 figures. So uh picked up these two. As you can see, they're still sealed. Um, I also got my boy, 
Shadow. And I am going to need one more of these. So if anybody runs into this, please let me know. Uh, but I did get Rouge as well. And both of these look really good. The wing on her is a little loose. Uh, it does kind of just flop around a bit. But uh, overall, she's a solid figure. I mean, all of these are solid. They look really good. The paint's clean for the most part. Uh, no real paint imperfections. Joints can get a little loose uh, the more you mess around with them. But I mean, they're still dope. They're nine bucks, so I'm not going to make any complaints. I did hear that there is an Amy and a Knuckles. Uh, I wasn't able to find those, but if any of you guys run into those, let me know. Uh, so let's go ahead and get into what you guys were ready for. And that's the Marvel Legends. First off, I picked up another one of this guy. I, I don't even know why. I just saw it and I was like, uh, yeah, let's get it. And it wasn't even on sale. Oh, well, actually it was on sale because this is brand new. This figure retails for like 32, I think is what I paid for it upon the first release. This one was 22 bucks and it's brand new. It says it on the sticker. I know you guys can't see it because of the ring light, but uh, it is brand new. So I'm very happy. I was able to get my hands on another one of these, even though we are getting another Captain America figure sometime soon. Uh, I don't know, but yeah, either way, got that. Now, next up, these weren't intentional, but I found these at Target. They were buy one, get one half off so i saw these and i know they're army builders so i had to get them you guys know i love black panther man uh i i am a sucker for black panther recently i've just been all in on black panther and so that's where my next couple of uh if i can talk man next couple of purchases came from uh, as you guys can see i'm not editing this video what i what i say is what you guys are going to receive so yeah i'm not redoing this so yeah um, deal with my broken English. Anyway, I got another one of this guy right here. Uh, so I'm sitting on three of these now in case y'all think I'm playing uno, dos, tres. I'm sitting on three of these right now. Um, and what's crazy was on the target website, they had a, uh, buy two, get one free, like absolutely free. So I ended up getting the boy, no more. I got him and Black Panther. And then I got my third one of these guys for my third army builder. So I got the third one for free. I, hey, I'm not going to complain. But uh, this is what I'm probably most excited for, yo. Like, this dude was such a beast in the movie. Like, I didn't know no more was as strong as he is. But this dude was so awesome, man. And... I really hope SH Figure Arts dives into making this figure. I doubt it's going to happen, but it would be so lit. Either way, I've heard nothing but good things about this figure, so uh, I'll be cracking it open pretty soon. I'm going to be taking some shots. This guy's going to be beating up on everybody. I'm telling y'all right now, if you see me on Instagram posting him whooping Goku, just know it is what it is. Don't even try to get on my case about it. Now, last but not least, for my last few Marvel Legends, I did also pick up... These two. I don't know what it is, man. I, I'm not like a big fan of zombies, but I was such a big fan of the Captain America figure they released, the zombie cap. I had to get these, yo. And someone tried to hide this Wanda. I was like, nah, bro, we ain't having that. I found this looking for something else. But uh, yeah, I did get Iron Man and I did get Wanda. So pretty big haul, as you guys can see, a ton of stuff. I also have Black Panther. It just didn't come in yet. So yeah, tons and tons and tons of stuff. But anyway, you guys, there is my haul of figures that who knows how long it will be before I get to them. Uh, I haven't messed around with anything, honestly. All of that stuff was absolutely brand new. Only ones that were open were Shadow and Rouge, and that's just because I was kind of eager to mess with those, and I like Shadow more than Sonic, so I got to him first. But uh, yeah, uh, a ton of stuff, man. And who knows when I'm going to get around to photographing this. I'm not going to be doing any reviews on these figures because, I mean, they've been out for a little while now. There's plenty of people that have reviewed all of these. So, uh, yeah, go check out those reviewers. But, uh, yeah, what would you guys think, man? I do also want to know what you guys got for Black Friday if you did any Black Friday shopping. Uh, it doesn't necessarily have to be from Target, Walmart, anything like that. It can be Big Bad Toy Store, Toys in the Box, Ami Ami. I just want to know what everyone picked up. So, uh, yeah, and then let me know what you think about my haul. But, yeah, quick video, I think. It's probably going to be 5, 10 minutes long. Who knows? Y'all know I talk. But, yeah, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I will be back with another review in the next couple of days. It will be the Figma Rengoku that everyone is already asking me about. 
chill. I ain't got it yet. But yeah, have a great rest of your day. Everybody stay safe wherever you are. And uh, we'll be back soon. Peace.